Yo, I have a question for you guys, actually. This video isn't going to be too informative, but remember when Shin Hati was fighting Sabine and they were like toe to toe with their lightsaber combat, which I thought was weird. And then how Shin got mad at Sabine when she saw her with Ahsoka and Balin and like force choked her. Uh, why didn't she just do that when they were fighting? kind of confused now typically in star wars in legends like unspoken jedi and sith would have like a powerful force bubble around them which would prevent one another from just like force choking each other to death no you get choked no you get choked no you get choked no you get pushed so and i i always thought of this as a theory this isn't anywhere like written or anything like that but remember when anakin and obi-wan were fighting dooku on the invisible hand and palpatine was watching and then we saw that like little cut where it went to palpatine and he was like yeah which was weird and i kind of took that as like maybe he was breaking Obi-Wan's shield where Count Dooku could use the force to like choke him and fling him into the freaking scaffold and drop it on him. I don't know how he didn't break his hips, but yeah, anyways. I always thought maybe like there was something there where he broke his bubble, his shield. Now, the same thing can be said with Shin Hati, but at the same time, Sabine doesn't have the force. There's no shield. I don't know. In a realistic situation there, I feel like if I was Shin Hati, why are you pulling out your lightsaber, dude? Like, you're just gonna I'm just choke you. Yeah. She's dead. She wins. She's like, all right, well, cool. I'm going to go help Maroc or whatever. She'd still get dusted by Ahsoka, no problem. But yeah, I just feel like that would have been something that would make a little more sense or even like throw her into a tree with the force. I don't know why, because it looked cooler with the lightsaber battle. But that's the thing is like, I don't want Sabine to be good at using a lightsaber against a well-trained dark Jedi. Like that just is to me is weird. But hey, I guess it made for like good TV or something, or maybe there's a reason behind it. But yeah. And also like, I don't know why she threw the smoke when she could have literally just like used four speed to go around Sabine and then like stab her or cut her. Just get it over with because you know this chick come back. So, you know, Reva style, they don't die. So I, I feel like, you know, that was a little bit weird to me. But if anyone has an explanation, love to hear it. All right. Well, thanks for watching today's video and I'll see you in the next one later.